As we celebrate Women's History Month, I would like to spotlight the inspiring women who currently serve as tribal court chief judges in six of the 12 federally recognized Native American tribes that we are fortunate to have here in Michigan. I am honored to serve alongside these judges on the Michigan Tribal State Federal Judicial Forum as our court systems collaborate on common statewide issues such as juvenile justice, problem solving courts, and child welfare. Working with tribal courts is important to the Michigan Supreme Court, and it is a passion of mine, deeply rooted in my family's tradition, as my dad, retired Justice Michael Kavanaugh, co-founded the forum in 2014, along with Chief Judge Michael Potosky of the Pokagon Band of Potawatomi Indians. All six of these women chief judges have distinguished themselves as leaders on the forum, on their bench, and in their respective communities. For example, Chief Judge Jocelyn Fabry of the Sault Ste. Marie Tribe of Chippewa Indians and Judge Leah Parrish of the Bay Mills Tribal Court each preside over healing to wellness court dockets, which often work with our state court, drug and sobriety courts, solving problems and saving lives. Chief Judge Melissa Pope of the Nottawasepi Huron Band of the Potawatomi Indians and Judge Angela Sherrigan of the Little River Band of Ottawa Indians have worked with the Women Lawyers Association of Michigan to spread awareness of the nationwide plight of missing and murdered Indigenous people, most of whom are women. And Judge Ann McNamara is actively involved in creating and curating legal resources and publications for the Hannaville Indian community. I also want to acknowledge and thank my friend and colleague, Chief Judge Allie Greenleaf Maldonado of the Little Traverse Bay Band of Odawa Indians. Chief Judge Maldonado was instrumental in drafting the Michigan Indian Family Preservation Act and has established a healing to wellness court as well a collaborative partnership among the community, service providers, the court, and adults who face substance abuse challenges grounded in Odawa values and teachings. Chief Judge Maldonado also performed my wedding in 2020, and she presented my husband and I and our children with a tribal blanket as a symbol of protection and comfort for our new family. It is a treasured memory of our family. In gratitude to all of my tribal court colleagues, I say miigwech, which means thank you in Ojibwe. As we celebrate Women's History Month, I encourage you to recognize the achievements of these tribal judges and learn more about the rich tradition of Michigan's indigenous people.